Accidents, even small ones, can be really scary. First, check on yourself. Are you okay? Then check the people around you. If anyone is injured, call 911 immediately. Then you can start moving people and vehicles to safety. Once everyone is safe, begin by taking pictures of the scene, only if it is safe to do so. This will help the police and your claims adjuster determine what happened. If you haven't yet dialed 911, do so now. Tell the dispatcher of your location and if anyone is injured. While waiting, you can exchange insurance information with the other driver and collect contact information from any witnesses. Note that road rage is on the rise and people are much quicker to anger now than they used to be. If you're not comfortable speaking with the other driver, you don't have to. Once the police arrive, they will collect both parties' information. You will have everything you need about the other driver when you receive the police report. Now that everything is settled, you can call your insurance agent to report the claim or file it on your provider's mobile app. The claims agent will ask you specific questions about the accident and then tell you what is and isn't covered by your policy. The claims agent will try to handle everything you need on this one phone call. That's why it's good to call them after things have calmed down. They will send a tow truck, set up an appointment at the body shop, and let you know when a rental car is available. If you don't have collision coverage, you will need to pay for your own tow truck to move your car to repair facility, salvage yard, or your home. Once the claims adjuster inspects the car, they will let you know how long the repair will take or deem it a total loss if it can't be fixed. Everyone worries that an accident will increase the cost of the insurance policy. If you are found not at fault for the accident, your rates probably won't change much. For people who have accident forgiveness on their policies, your price should stay around the same, but you may see a slight increase because you'll lose any safe driving discounts you may have had. If you are at fault for the accident, your premium will go up, but no one will know how much until your policy renews. If you've had a great driving record before the accident, your rate increase may be modest, say $100 per policy term. However, if you have a history of infractions like multiple speeding tickets or prior accidents, the increase could be several hundred dollars per term. Your driving record will follow you to every insurance company, but not all accidents are rated the same. At Jerry, we can help you find the right discounts and help you find the best insurance company for your needs, even after an accident.